Good morning. This is Pastor Tim Wells, pastor of Cross of Christ Lutheran Church in Aurora, Nebraska. This morning I want to read to you from the book of 2 Thessalonians. This is going to be the last paragraph in that book. This is chapter 3, verses 17 and 18. And here the Apostle Paul writes, I, Paul, write this greeting with my own hand. This is the sign of genuineness in every letter of mine. It is the way I write. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. That's the final chapter, the final words of Paul in his letter, his second letter to the Thessalonians. And you're probably wondering, why on earth are we focusing on these verses today? What's a devotion going to be about based on these words of Paul? Well, here Paul is saying, look, I'm writing a letter. You can tell by my handwriting. In other letters that Paul writes, he talks about the big letters he uses, the big handwriting he uses. It's obvious when Paul is writing something just based on the style of handwriting. It is the way he writes. And so he says, look, you can tell, you can recognize my handwriting and know without a doubt this is me writing to you. That idea got me thinking about God. And how do we know without a doubt in our lives when it is God writing to us, when it is God speaking to us? How can we recognize without a doubt God's handwriting? The obvious answer is this book, right? The Bible. The words on these pages are God's inspired words. And so whenever we read and hear these words, God is speaking directly to us. So how do we recognize God's handwriting? We recognize it when the words come from this book, from the Bible. But where else do we experience and see God's handwriting in our lives? We see God's handwriting in our lives in the way that he shows his love to us. And where do we experience God's love for us? Ultimately, we experience God's love for us through Jesus' death on the cross. This is God's perfect handwriting. As he comes into the world in human flesh and through his death on the cross forgives our sins. Through his resurrection wins for us the gift of eternal life. Each and every day, as you're listening for God's voice, trying to figure out what is God saying, ultimately, this is what God is saying to you. He is saying, I love you. I forgive you. I want you to be mine forever. And how do we know that's God speaking it? Because this is God's handwriting. The cross is God's handwriting to us. As he shows us just how much he loves us and wants to save us and make us his forever. So as you go about your day to day and you're listening for God's voice in your life, you can recognize God's voice through his handwriting. We recognize God speaking to us through his love shown to us on the cross. And we, of course, recognize God speaking to us through the words of Scripture. Let's pray. Lord God, Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for revealing to us your handwriting. For making it clear and obvious to us when you are speaking to us in our lives. Teach us, Lord, to recognize your handwriting to recognize your inspired word, the Bible, to recognize your love shown to us through your Son, our Savior, Jesus' death on the cross. In your name we pray. Amen. 
All right. Pray God's blessings on your weekend and hope to see you Sunday. Amen.